Good morning, my dear friends in Christ. Today we begin this Sunday reflection in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. We thank God for another day of worship. Our gospel passage for today is from Matthew 18, verse 21 to 35. Last week, we spoke about making peace with our neighbors. Today, we are looking at the issue of forgiveness. It is an important part of making peace with our neighbors. It is an important part of making peace with our neighbors as Peter raised a serious question in today's passage. How many times should I forgive my brother? The answer of Jesus Christ is that we must forgive anybody who offends us 70 times 7 times. Hear me again. Jesus said that we must forgive anyone that offends us 70 times 7 times. So you must forgive 490 times. Wow. The message is that forgiveness has no limit. You cannot say because you forgive somebody in the morning, you will not forgive him in the evening or the next day if he or she still offends you. Beyond the fact that we must be ready to forgive at all times is the most serious issue that if you don't forgive your brother, your heavenly father will not forgive you and if god does not forgive our sins our religion and service is all in vain you must forgive others in order to enjoy forgiveness from god in our lord's prayer the request is that god should forgive us our sins as we forgive others forgiveness begets forgiveness you must give it to be able to receive it in our passage, a debtor was give, forgiven, but because he refused to forgive another person who was owing him, he lost the forgiveness that he had received. Hear this, each time you refuse to forgive a person who offends you, you are blocking the way to your own forgiveness by men or by God. I want to repeat this so that you will hear it. If at the end of the day, you refuse to forgive a person who offends you. It means that you are blocking the way to your own forgiveness by men or by God. I ask you now, do you want to be forgiven? Then you must forgive all those who offended you. I pray that you will receive grace to forgive people truly from your heart. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen. As we forgive, may you also receive forgiveness from God through Christ our Lord. Amen and amen. Forgiveness is not an easy task. But I pray that the Lord will give us the grace to be able to forgive one another. Forgive that person that has offended you. Forgive anybody that is blocking your own blessing. Because when you don't forgive, you're blocking your own blessing. Nobody is worth denying you of your blessing. Nobody is worth making you not to receive from God. So, brothers and sisters, forgive. 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 May the Lord help us. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you.